Welcome back everyone to the complete pine leaf where today we are performing a challenge for Cranach and starting book six of the epic story where we are to get a rubbing. No, not a massage. We're supposed to get a rubbing of a statue to find out the reason why it's creating such troubles. This is Angmar. What do you expect? Statues do weird things. Here we are at Torgarvin, where we have these Trev Duverdain, who maybe we'll have some pages that we can get. But in addition to that, we need to get a rubbing from one of those. Hey, there, there's the evil statue we need to get the rubbing from right there. I managed to finish out my wargs, but we also have a warg deed to worry about, so I will kill a few extra of those. And it might also help in getting a few task items here and there. Uh, maybe not good ones. I don't. Because I noticed that the local task board in Edokhara doesn't give you anything for the Council of the North. I presume you have to get into the second half before you get any of that stuff. Yeah, Council of the North is 300! Hmm. Yeah, not too much of that so far. Let's Lesser Watching Stone. We collected the Watching Stone rubbing good now we need to get some pendants, some amulets, and some pendants. I don't I don't think this guy has one of those. I think you have to go in a little bit deeper, but we're getting close to it. Yeah, he doesn't carry one. It's starting in this area where you start to get your amulets and the like. Like there's the first one right there. This is always a tough one from the point of view of seeing. Since they're inside the tent and as soon as you step inside they take notice uh, and of course we get the camera going oops 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 oops. There you go. Now where were we? Ah oh, yeah these guys and of course a couple more wargs. Now we'll be going down to that area in a later part of the storyline but this is not the time right now we'll go this way where we should get a few more of them and who knows maybe one of them well they'd certainly have plenty of well-kept mathems not that I really need them anymore seeing how I'm already kindred but that's another matter. All right, there's all our amulets. Looks like, oh, we've got them both. Whee! Now it's time to find those Ungbur's orcs over in Morfield. Ah, I found it. Where we've got three orcs on the outside. I know that's not many when you consider how many orcs I have to kill for this. But there will be a few more within the cave. And there we should get more than enough in order to complete this little quest inside. And of course this is a place full of wargs and orcs and other nasty things. I really didn't have to go out of my way in order to get wargs, but then this is Angmar. You never need to go out of your way to find wargs. They're all over the place. The land is riddled with them. And we try to get rid of this riddlement whatever. Alright, that takes care of the skirmishers. And here's the captain. So you need one captain, several warriors, and a couple of skirmishers. 
Now at this time, sometimes what you could do is if you're tired of the area, you, you can at this point go outside because usually the a warrior has respawned. But of course, if a lot of people are in the area, someone else might be out there already taking care of them. So it doesn't hurt to take care of them inside. And oh boy, they're all dead. That completes the quest, so let's get back to camp. If we're lucky, they'll be impressed. You, are a stranger to this land. you have done very well against the Wargs, Pine Leaf. You're welcome. And what about this thing? Vitality will... meh. And what do you say? I've managed to... You are a stranger to these lands. Yes, all right. My brothers will be pleased with your service in their honor, Pineleaf. I give you the thanks in their stead for slaying the orcs of Moorfield. For my part, I believe you're trustworthy, but it is up to Cranach to rule on this matter. Yes, of course. It'll always be his... Ooh, what can I do with that one? Nothing, really. And what do we have over here? I do not know what will become of my people. The evil lords of Angmar must be very displeased now that their Trev du Verdain were, that were given to Galvin, for you have bloodied their noses with your attack. I will tell Cranach of your success, and he will have no doubts of it. These amulets and pendants seeing of your victory. Alrighty then. We'll take that and... Mm, nah. So much for that. Oh, yes, of course. Cranog! We can't forget Cranog! The hills of Agmar are not friendly to the unwary. I have been told of your successes. You have taken the first step on this path, but the road is winding, and you have just begun to walk upon it. Right. But not all need to be as suspicious as I, for it is duty of the chieftain to be guarded in all dealings with outsiders. Finan, east of here, in the central island of Akhaire, has heard of your victories and wishes to speak with you. Alrighty. Oh, we need to get the shoes of Fem. Might. Oh, actually, that's not a bad pair of shoes. I think I'll take it. Would you lend me a moment of your time? So my people are satisfied with your deeds, but there is still more to be done if your hopes to be accepted in the Trev Galorg of Akhaire. Right, then let's do some tasks for um, Achena, Cameron, and Rona. There we go. And that will be uh, this way. Hello there, I heard you have a task for me. Many urgent matters to discuss. I have heard of your task, Pine Leaf, and know exactly how you can prove your worthiness uh, to me and to all of us. This land must be coaxed to give us food, but she is more generous with gems such as the bloodstones which were used in several crafts. But the shiny stones attract more than the Trev Galore who goes searching for them. The hill beasts covet bloodstones and will often fight to the death to recover them. Right, so I'm to recover bloodstones from from those beasts. All right. Come hither, Southron. I would speak with you. You have already been to the fortress of Torgaven, right? The home that was given to the Trev du Verdain by their new masters. Wrath believes that the resting of the tokens of the enemy from Trev du Verdain or Trev Galvain is enough. I don't agree. Return to there and destroy the standards that fly upon their walls. All right, then. And what do you say? There are many urgent matters to discuss. Cranach is waiting for my judgment of your worth. This is no small burden, and I will not make my decision lightly. But I thank him for the attention, for there is something you can do to earn my judgment. My brother Tazgal is a hunter of no small worth, but he has not returned from his latest foray into the wild. I ask you to travel north to Fasach Laran and search for my brother. Give him your aid. And if he deems you worthy, then so do I. Alrighty then. That's the next group. But of course, we can't forget Kurinir. 
Hello there, here's the rubbing. How can I be of service? Ah, the rubbing, good. Let me see it. What do you need? These runes are of an elvish mode, but they're the language is the black speech, in which I am not well versed. But I do know a little, and I can see that these runes speak of a heart located within the stone. Perhaps if I can study one of these stone hearts, a way to undo the spell upon them can be found. There are some lifeless stones east of here from which you may collect such a heart, without fear. Bring me a stone heart as quickly as you may, so that we may be done with our duty. All right, then, I shall do so. But first, we need to take care of Tazgal and the split stones and also standards. Yes, the standard affair. Ah, a hill beast. That's a good start to get some bloodstones, right? We don't have too much blood on the bloodstones. How would you know if there was blood on the bloodstones? Hmm, interesting question. I found Tazgal, and fortunately, he's in a bit of a wet area. Oh well. Uh, actually, before I do that, there have been one or two times where I've been interrupted by a warg trying to do this. Apparently, Tazgal doesn't like wargs either. Hello there. Will you be sojourning here? My sister sent you. She worries always, despite my assurances. But you are not one of the Trevgalorg and do not have a femme. I will help you test your strength, and perhaps my task here will go more quickly for it. The hill beasts of Nod Nathair have proven a savage menace. Hill beasts, well, I need to kill some hill beasts for their stones anyway. I would speak with you, Selfie. I came forth from Malkhaira intending to halt the spread of hill beasts further into the Fossach Laran Pineleaf, but the creatures are too many. If you are deserving of the friendship of the Trev Galorg, you will aid me in my charge. Northwest of here you will find a sloping path into Nod Nathair. It will be place of it's a place of menace, and from there will come the hill beasts that prowl the Fossach Laran. Defeat as many of them and find them there and speak again with me. In other words, I need to kill tell t ten of them. Assuming I can find them. I don't think that should be too difficult to find them because they're up here this way, right? Yeah, here it is. Just making sure I thought I smelt a warg in the area, but apparently not. But we'll take care of hillbees. And at the same time, perhaps get a bloodstone or three. Good. And it should be... Let's see. Yeah, there seem to be... Seems like they are really prone to collecting those bloodstones because I've seen be one for one on those so far. Yeah. That's when you get a 100% drop. Oh yes. Concerning the morales of these creatures I'm fighting, I seem to be getting to them pretty quickly. Now part of the course is I'm level 46 right now. But the other reason is that it looks like the morale levels are a little bit lower because every once in a while they try to tweak the morale levels of everything to see if they can finally get a good balance of values. And they cited the ones in the levels 40 shown, I think early 50s also, are a little bit on the light side. So we can expect these to be increased in the near future. Actually, they're going to be increased in a patch. Well, as I record this, the patch is tomorrow. So I think the patch would have already have happened by the time this posts. And now, let's see. We have 
Oops, I need one more before I head back. There you go. So I've got the bloodstones. I've taken care of the beasts. Now let's get back to Tazgal. I am done. Trust does not come easily among the trade below. Good, I'm glad to hear that. Now that we may proceed with the next step of our hunt. Yeah? I would speak with you, Southron. Yes, we're hunting the we're hunting two hill beasts that are mighty in this area, and they are too aged and cautious to come out unaware. So we are going to get some food for them. Yay! Crawler meat. Crawler meat. We need to find some crawler meat. Okay. How about warg meat? Hmm. Nope, could not find the warg anywhere. But there should be crawlers around here. And this place, ah, there we go. The place was crawling with crawlers a while ago, so we should be finding a few of them. That's one down. Good, and I'm glad that we can get remains from them in pretty quick order. Just be happy that there isn't a deed here for killing crawlers, because, oh, crawler deeds are so annoying. I still need to finish the one from Rivendell. I mean, from the Troll Shawls. Let's see, there is number... Good. And that should leave uh, this one. Good. Now, let's head back and find out what he wants us to do with it. Will this do? Will you be sojourning here? The remains of these crawlers are not pleasant to smell or look upon, but trust me when I say that they're a delicacy to the creatures we hunt. I'll prepare the bait from what you've brought here. Bangrath and Murgrath can be drawn out of hiding. All right, let's go then. Come hither, Southron. I would speak with you. Yes, l yes, we have what we need to draw Bangrath and Murgrath out of hiding, Pineleaf. Let us travel into Nanathair and use this bait to put an end to this menace. Here, let's go. Two terrible beasts, Bangrath and Murgrath, threaten the safety of the Trave Galor, the hillmen of Ohio. Their reign of terror must be put to an end. You were a stranger to these lands. I have the crawler remains you gathered, Brineleaf. Do, do you smell the awful stench? And to the hillbees, the odor will be impossible to resist. Let's begin our hunt, and we will lure Bangrath and Murgrath from hiding. Keep a watchful eye. For hillbeasts will be drawn by the scent of the bait I carry. Right. Let us go, Pineleaf. Do not let the rain interfere with your concentration. Wonderful. Well, do what I can and... Ah! We are seen. Steal yourself. Oh, yes, there we are. This is it. We could take care of these in short order. There you go. There are more hill beasts approaching. There are. Somewhere. Ah, here they are. First we get two, then we get three. Do we get four next? Maybe I better not give them any ideas. Nope. There you go. Behind us! Oh, only two again. Alright, fine. And we can take them quickly. We're safe for now, but we must press on. Yeah, alright, there you go. Press, 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 press. Ah! Ah oh yes, this little area where I didn't bother before. I will put the bait on the flat stone. 
Ready yourself. All right, I'm ready. I'm, uh, it looks like we've got somebody's. I smell heel beast. Yes, there they are. This will call Bankroth and Murgroth. I, I hope so. Or, uh, oh, here's Bankroth. Bankroth. That's it. There you go. That ends Bankroth. She'll no longer cause us pain. But where is Merigroth? Uh, I have no idea. Right, well, that's. Well, if it's half the breeding pair down, we. At least it'll slow down the breeding rate. Right? Well, I guess until they have a new breeding pair, but that's. Eh, something for another day well think this is the right place hold on I hear footsteps approaching Ooh, what's going on now hmm stay alert the Trev du Verdain are not to be trusted uh, so I've been given the impression I thought I smelled the odor of the Trev galore here. And you thought it was just the smell of Hill Beast. You're not worthy of notice, Drosten. I would not sully my blade with your blood. Strong words for a coward such as you, Tazgall. You have not called for the Klukoths against us. You tremble at the memory of our strength. Right. Drosten, we have to go. Something comes. In other words, they flee. And leave Murgroth to us. And... Uh, it looks like he's going to go down. All right. There you go. Murgroth is defeated. We're victorious, despite the interference of Drolstan. That's now settled. Greetings, Sovereign. The Trev Duverdine and the Trev Galorg were once one people. But over the years, they grew apart, splintered as tribes sometimes do. There was always hope we would one day be reconciled, but... That hope is now gone. Drosten spoke of Klukoth, a ceremonial combat that was once used to determine the ruling order of the various tribes. The latest Klukoth was called many years ago, and Nassan, the warrior of the Trev Galorg, was slain. But this is not the time to speak of such things. Our victory over the hill beast should now not be tainted by such unhappy memories. You have aided me with my femme. And that brings honor to both of us. Go now to my sister Rona and tell her that I shall soon return to Alkhire. There, where did you say? Yes, I, I know where she is. There you go. I'll return to no Rona. But first, we have to worry about some standards, which is what we'll do in the next episode of The Complete Pineleaf.